Hello everybody, welcome back. This is episode 3 of my Skyrim Let's Play. I want to say I am so sorry for what happened last episode with the whole friggin' no commentary thing. That was... Uh, it, it also sucked ass to edit. Alright, well here's like a list of things that we basically got done during the whole last episode. I'll just like do a quick overview. So between episodes I leveled up my smithing. As you can see I leveled up my smithing. I only put one thing towards it. And the other ones I put towards two-handed weapons. There was a guy asking me about a woman. It was like some guy who came up and I think he gave me a quest. I have like a little clip of that. There's also no talking in that. I made a clip because like the guy came up and I was trying to level up my smithing and he came out of nowhere. So I just recorded it because cause I was going to put it in this video and I'll show that clip right now. A woman. A foreigner in these lands. Redguard like us. She is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information regarding her location. We are not welcome here in Whiterun, so we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. We're looking for a fugitive who comes from Hammer. It's none of your concern. If that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. Okay, so we did that. We finished the Golden Claw mission. We finished and started several quests. I'll just show you my quest right now. See, there's the Find the Red Guard woman. I don't know why. I just realized, but the, the the thing has been fucking up recently, and my mouse has been like coming out of nowhere. So I just have, I have to like put it down there. Like my mouse, last episode, it did something, and now like it just comes out of nowhere. But anyway, here's the quest for the to find the red guard woman, the dragon rising, which is the main quest, and we have several side quests here. I activated the warrior stone after I go to like that little cave at the very beginning, so now I have the warrior stone. I also mentioned last video that when I eventually am able to marry someone, I'm going to be marrying Janessa because I think she's just helpful. But I'll never have her, like, follow me because I know if I have her follow me, I'll probably end up losing her. And then, like, everything she has will be lost because I can just see that happening. We completed the quest where we have to deliver that sword from this blacksmith over here. We had to deliver a sword to that, like, guy way up there. We did that, and I think now we're able to purchase a host here in Whiterun, which is this little host here. We got several quests from the court wizard, such as visit the College of Winterhold, which I'll do way later on. I know that's a good spot to get Danger Hearts, because like, there's some guy that if you just keep like waiting two days, he sells Danger Hearts, which is helpful if you want to get Danger Armor, which I probably end up will getting soon. I also cleared one dungeon. I don't think I kept this in the video, but I cleared the South... Brittleshin Pass dungeon, I cleared that. And like I said, I leveled up my smithing. I was gonna level up to 100, but that's kind of hard to do when you're at a low level and have like no money for iron, and you don't have any like carry weight to go mine iron ore. So it's only at 27 now, but I'm gonna be leveling up my smithing and my sneaking off video, off camera or whatever, because cause I'm gonna be exploiting glitches like a fuckboy to level up my smithing and sneaking, and just watching me repeatedly make iron daggers or stab a gray beard in the back is not exciting. I also went on a white run and I got the chest from there so I have some like I have some of this stuff which is kind of new because I went under white run and I like did the glitch where you can get the chest from the sky forge up there. That's that's not really that important but I did get a few new weapons like this ancient Nord battle axe which is dank and also I got several books because I don't like, I don't actually read them, but I know that when I actually get my house and you can have a bookshelf, I like putting books on the bookshelf just because it feels cool. And yeah, that's basically the whole overview of last episode within like four minutes. I'm just going to talk to this woman real quick and see if I have anything to like sell. Also, my gold right now is 1,318. It would have been more because I went to go sell stuff, but I realized that I was buying everything. Like I bought all of like all of her shit. And then I finally realized that I was buying stuff and not selling stuff, so all my gold went away and then I sold stuff and got back up to here. If I didn't buy her ship by accident and I just sold stuff, I would have had at least 2,000 to 3,000 gold. But she has nothing here that I really want. So now we're going to do this mission where you have to meet Irolith near the Western Watchtower and this is where we encounter our first dragon. I also want to mention that last episode, there was a lot of fucking editing. Like, there was a lot of editing. Before it was all edited and everything, it was an hour and 14 minutes long until I edited it down to, I think it's like 30 minutes. 
there was a lot of fast forwarding, a lot of adding little captions. It was fucked up. It was a lot of work. No, get back. It's still here somewhere. It, it was a bitch. I'm going to put a screenshot up right now. If it's still like, if I can still get the screenshot of it, of like the little edit timeline thing. And you can just see all the shit that's there. Where? I don't see the dra- oh, there it is. And also, I, I've been like, maybe wanting to start something. It's not a new series or anything, but at the beginning of some videos, I just want to like, pop up a random picture I made in Photoshop. Because if I'm not editing, recording a video, or playing a video game, I'm just messing around on Photoshop making stupid shit. And I just want to pop this photo up right now of Caillou with the Lenny face and it says weed. I just, I just want to pop that up on the screen because I think it's fucking hilarious. That's basically what I do on my free time when I'm not doing anything. Holy shit, I'm almost dead. Alright, potions, healing, just use a bunch of those. Basically just stay back and let everyone else do the work. Or you can pull out a bow and hope to actually hit him. But he's a bastard to hit because he's like flying around and everything. I'm going to go up here and use my bow. Get a nice vantage point. Nice and high up, you know. If I can even find him. He's not on like my little mini-map thing. Oh, there he is. He's down. He's down there. Alright. Fire. Oh, he's almost dead. Oh shit, he moved. Oh my god. He's dead. Alright, let's go down there. Alright, how you doing? Search. I'm gonna take his bones and shit, because that stuff is worth a lot of money. I'm gonna take back my arrows. And I'm gonna take this stuff, because I like collecting those. Like, armor things from the guards. I think it's cool. I'm absorbing your soul, big boy. Oh boy, I got my first ever dragon soul. Oh yeah, I got an achievement. Alright, use your new shout power. Let's do it. Alright, shouts. Unrelenting force. How do I... Oh, it must take a second for the shout to actually... Alright, can I get it now? Is it, why is... Why, it still says zero dragon souls. What the fuck? Or did I already, like, put it towards it? No? No? Okay. Yeah, boy. In the very oldest tale. Ah, you, what you're saying isn't important. I'm just going to skip through everything. Alright, now we have to head back to Whiterun, I believe. Alright, let's go. So I've been thinking for this series. So like my Dead Island series, as you may know, I use a lot of fast forwarding and Undertale music. Because I think, like, you don't really have to move that far on that game, so it's, it's okay. But this game you have to do a lot of walking. So I've been thinking about instead of fast forwarding for this series, I should just cut shit right out because there's a lot of shit to fast forward like in episode 2 if you actually managed to watch the whole thing there was like a whole like 2 or 3 minute I'm assuming it was 2 or 3 minutes I, I didn't watch the whole thing over but it was like it was a long time of just pure fast forward music so I've been thinking for this let's play I should just cut some shit out but I'll, I'll figure that out eventually like this little walk I'm doing to white or not to white run the little walk I'm doing right now to the dragon's reach if I weren't talking I would probably add some music and fast forward it but since I just what I just said like maybe not do that and just cut right to it I could just cut right to it I'm not gonna do neither of them right now though because I'm talking but if I weren't talking I don't know if it's best to fast forward or to cut out like, cause I just want this to be as best as it can be you know now let me in shit alright let me in I am a dragonborn. Let me talk to this guy real quick just to make sure I can purchase the house. Okay, I can. I fucking ate it. Alright, I'm, I'm just skipping through. Like, is, is this shit important, what you're saying? Alright, I got the axe of white run. I'll probably never use it, so... It's just something that I'm gonna have sit there and... Have on, like... A statue thing. One of those little... Thingies on the wall. Alright, I can leave. Alright, let's go. I'm probably gonna fast forward this because this is, like, sort of important. Like, walking up the mountain is kind of important. So, like, my friend Owen, he commented on my last video saying, like, I didn't have to do this because it's not a walkthrough, it's a let's play. 
but I just I just feel like I just want everything to be in it, you know? Like, like I don't want to record a whole episode and just not have it in, but he said that I didn't have to go through all the work of editing it because it's a let's play and not a walkthrough, so I didn't have to show it. But I wanted to show it, but like I don't know if if I need to, like cuz this is a let's play. This is not a walkthrough. If this was a walkthrough, fuck that. I'm not doing a walkthrough. I'm doing a let's play. Cuz this is a walkthrough. It's like be the most shit walkthrough ever. So that's why it's a let's play, not a walkthrough. Alright, so speak to the graybeards is what we are doing. So let me open up my map real quick. Alright, I have to walk all the way over there. I fucking hate that. Like, I remember when I first had to do this and I got lost and I, like, was walking all over the place. Yeah, I'm gonna double check. I don't think you can, like, get a carriage ride there. Because it's not, like, a big city. But I'm gonna check anyway. Okay, Iverstead is not on there. Alright, I'm gonna have to fucking walk there. God damn. Alright, so it's right there, so I think it's just gonna be... Mm, ah, fuck it. I'll just fuck walk around. See, like this? This would be some extremely... Th this right here, this would be a scene that has, like, a really long fucking fast forward. So I kind of, like, I think I should cut this out. Because y you know where I'm going. I'm going all the way over here way the fuck over here and just like showing all this and fast forward would probably still have like fucking three minutes maybe even five minutes because it's gonna take a long time to get there like there's gonna be a lot of shit getting there like it's gonna take a long long time especially since i barely even know where i'm going because i'm probably gonna like make the wrong turn 16 times. I'm just gonna try to stick to like the path. Maybe I'll get there a little bit faster. Oh shit, you know. Right, let me check this cave out over here, this little dungeon, because sometimes dungeons will take you out like at the other side of some places. Like, because I know that there's like a dungeon somewhere that like takes you right through the whole fucking mountain. I'm gonna go through this dungeon and hope that's what happens with this one. All right, I remember this dungeon. This is like, so memorable for me because I remember doing this one so much and then dying so often. Right, I just got a note. I'm gonna look at it, see if it's important at all. Uh, your little uh, all right, whatever. It's not important. It didn't give me a mission quest, so it's not important. Let's take your cheese. More cheese. Oh, shit, not your pot. One v one, no scope, me mate. I also have on like the sound subtitles, like the the noise subtitles when people like go to swing something and it's like Ugh! I have that on and I don't really like it but I'm not gonna bother changing it because I'll probably turn off the wrong ones and then they just won't turn back on and all that shit that's this blind guy Rodolf? Is that you? Rodolf? yes alright then you can like pickpocket him I'm pretty sure Alright, let's take his gold. Oh shit, he noticed. He's dead. Alright. He had more gold. I'm gonna take this book, because like I said, I like to just take books and have them. I like, I literally never read them, I just think they look nice on like, a nice little, nice little bookshelf. Okay. I'd probably use like, my bow and stuff here, but I'm not gonna bother. Because I'm just gonna go in here nice and fast. I fucking, I hate like, well, I shouldn't say I hate, but he's like, this guy's a bandit, but he's a, a magey bandit, you know, he like uses spells and stuff. Like, I personally don't like using spells and all that fun stuff, but if you're a person that likes to play as a mage, you're pretty fucking overpowered because, what the fuck happened there? Because, like, s spells and stuff in this game, some of them are fucking powerful, man. And like, there's all the... Like ones where you can heal yourself and stuff. I wanted the Skyrim book, an explorer's guide to Skyrim. Oh, it updated my map. It's pretty cool. Like some of these books are actually pretty cool sounding. It's not like I'm ever gonna read them, but they just sound cool. There's an alchemy tab, table, lab, alchemy lab. Speaking of al alchemy lab, there was also another quest that we did last video that I forgot to mention in the overview. When you first talked to the uh, court wizard, it was like there was a mission not even really a mission. I wouldn't even say it's a quest. It's just like use the alchemy 
or fucking enchanter table. You just had to go on it and you didn't even have to enchant anything. So I did that as well. Which is a really quick and easy quest. Yeah, do you get anything good on you? You got some bread. Oh, it's a wolf. Let's open it up. Alright, there we go. That took quite a while. Oh, I can level up. Right, there's a minor health potion. This wolf has some wolf pelt. I'll take that. Just so I can make leather for those iron daggers when I level up my, uh... When I level up my smithing, because leather... When you go to buy leather, it's actually pretty fucking expensive. And it sucks. So, yeah. Search these bandits. Right, I'm gonna level up. Alright, so I'm gonna put my token... I'm gonna put one towards Magicka. I'm not gonna put a lot towards Magicka because... I'm not a big Magicka person, but if I ever, like, do use it, it's for healing myself. Because if I'm almost dead and I have no health potions and I can just walk around a corner, I will use, like, my healing potion. Not my healing potion, sorry. My healing spell where I can heal myself. Like, I will use that. Alright, now on the other side of this little door, I remember there being, like, some big-ass pain-in-the-ass guy. Yeah, this guy right here used to fuck me over so hard. Alright, I'm gonna save. Time to end this little game. Time to end this little game. Alright, he's actually not that difficult right now. That was really easy. I remember the first time I had to beat him. He fucked my shit up every time. I'm gonna take those gauntlets. I'll take his journal too. Alright, let's see how much his gauntlets do compared to mine. Alright, 13... Mine do 13, and his do... Where are they? And his do 16, okay. And not only are they better for armor, but they also do 15% more damage with two-handed weapons. Which is very helpful and very nice. Did I equip them? I'm pretty sure I equipped them. Okay, I did. Alright, there's a chest right here. Ooh, one-handed attacks do 15% more damage. Probably won't wear that, but, you know, it's all good. Now let me check with the map. Okay, didn't make much progress. I'm just gonna hopefully get down here without dying. Ouch. Alright, anyway. Onward with our fun quest. Oh man, there's a cave over there and I really want to go through it, but I don't want to like waste time. There's also a stone up here, so I'm just gonna check out these stones. And see what these stones have. Or it might be just a stone. How the fuck do I get up there? Okay, I think there's like skeletons here actually. Skeletons and some guy that like revives them. Oh wow, I just killed him very, very fast. Okay, there are skeletons. Eh. Eh. Alright, ooh, beehive husk. Alright, the Ritual Stone. What does this stone have? Once a day, those under the sign of the Ritual can reanimate nearby corpses to fight for them. You may only have one blessing at a time. Ah, nah, I'm not going to use that. There's a cave over here, and I, I really like clearing out caves. That's one of my favorite things on this game, honestly. And I don't want to, like, just have it sitting here, you know? Alright. Ooh. Oh, shit. This one is just a troll, and trolls are kind of diff Yeah, fuck it, actually... We're just going to have this one sit here and we're going to do it some other day because trolls are fuck. Anyway, let's get on with our little journey to Iverstead. Or Iversteed, I don't know how to say it. You dirty folk, get back her. Alright, alright, we're going to get that moose. Alright, fucking no, we're not. Alright, there's a giant camp up here, so let's check it out for now. I probably won't do much at it other than die. I remember when I first went to this friggin little giant camp I was like I had no idea what to do because they kept on killing me so I went in there and I got their attention and then I went on like one of these little pillar things so that they couldn't hit me and then I just kept on like I just looked down and I kept on shooting them with arrows while they were trying to hit me very very smart alright we're not even gonna attempt to fuck with them yet so let's just go alright can I make this e Ah, fuck it. Uh, yeah, I knew that was gonna do something. Shit, damn it. No, fuck. Ah, oh, god damn. I hate dying in this game. Ah, I'm way over here. It's not really that far, but still. Alright, we're not even gonna bother going to visit that giant camp again. 
it's not important. There's only death up there, so I'm not a fan of that, considering I just died and I want to kill myself. All right, there's bandits here, so let's get them. Oh, hey, they're actually talking. You know what? Fuck you, bitch. You're a single bandit, you shit. Alright, this chest has like a, a trap on it. Oh, fucker. Yeah. 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 What? Right there, it wasn't letting me search her body. <laughs> oh shit, I almost fell. Leave me alone. I've done no harm. Oh no. Just go up. So I'm sure there's some helpful shit up here. Pew. Pew. No. I want to actually like search their bodies for shit, you know? Alright, let's pull out a bow. Alright, let's do this. Oh, look, look at that body. You see that body floating away? Look at, look at it. Look at it. <laughs> Boom! Get no scoped. All right, where are you? Is that you right there? Shit, you're like moving around a lot. Shit. Shit. All right, you're gonna walk into this, okay? No. Okay. Boom. I didn't shoot it far enough. All right. All right. Boom. No. All right. Boom. There we go. Boom. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And it's following the arrow. Boom. I fucking love that. That's so cool. Look at that moose right there. He's so frightened to be alive. Alright, but we're not even gonna try to shoot him. Alright, let's pull out my Nord Axe. I think I went up there for no reason. Because there's literally nothing up there besides an enemy. I don't know what's here. It's been a long time, so... Let's just check... There might be something nice. Some nice shoes. I'll take that pickaxe. Minecraft pickaxe. I love me some Minecraft. Who maybe I can make something with what I just got. Let's find out. Alright, so there was a clove of garlic. And there was some of this. Some of this. Let's craft it. Ooh, potion of regenerate health. It's pretty cool actually. I'll probably never ever do that again, but that was pretty cool actually. Oh, there's a chest. How nice. Oh, fuck. That broke instantly. Alright. Boom. Open. Sesame. There's a hide helmet and some gold. Oh, boy. Ooh, books. Maybe there's a nice one here. All these ones that have, like, the word V6 in them, I don't take them. Because that means I have to find the other volumes and I can't be bothered doing that shit. There's a bed. That's nice. There's another chest. Ooh, there's actually some nice shit in here. Ooh, there's a dragon head up there. That means there's a dragon. And, like, a part of a shout. It's pretty cool. I'll eventually do all those. Oh, hunting bow of cowardice. I'll take it because it's worth a lot of money. Oh, wow. I'm carrying too much to run. That's a damn shame. I don't even know why I have this. Or these. This shit takes up a lot of weight, so I'll get rid of it. Alright, let's quit wasting time and get to where we need to be. There's a dungeon, and as much as I want to clear it, I'm not going to. But there is a fox. Shia! What? What? Alright, there we go. Let's take its pelt. Alright, Iverstead. We're on our way. Ooh, what is this? Stormcloak soldier. Alright. Windhelm. Riften. Iverstead. They're all in this direction. Alright, shit, which way do we go? Do we go up the little hill? Mmm, spicy decisions. Let's just keep following this path. Ooh. Wait, is she the Red Guard woman? Let me look at my quests. Find the Red Guard woman. A group of men calling themselves out looking for. Oh, maybe this is the woman. It is. 
What was all that about? So, so, do I, do I kill you? Am I supposed to kill you? But, okay, the quest said in White Run, and this is not White Run. Let me save my game, and then I'll kill her. Alright, maybe, yeah, yeah. Just, just, just save the game, just in case this fucks up anything. Alright, she had boots and clothes. Okay, we're just gonna reload just in case. You know, you know. And we're not gonna kill her, and we're gonna go. It's a big fucking cat. That does a lot of damage. Alright, um, use one of those real quick. Now, fuck you. Damn. I'll take your eye because it's scary looking. Let me look at my shouts. Why? Wait, did I have to put the shout on? I'm fucking stupid. I had to equip the shout first. Run at me, boy. Pshio. Whoop. Bam. Ooh. Snap leg cave discovered. Should we go through it? Let's do it. Alright, what's in here? can't remember if I've mentioned this in episode 2, I think it was. But some caves have just animals, and some have animals in both humans, and some have just animals. Or some just have... Some just have humans, and some just have animals, and some have both. That's what I meant to say. I think I, like, repeated myself twice there for a second. So I just wanted to make sure by starting over. And usually when they have an animal, they're... The animal is usually a bear, or it's a troll, because I consider a troll an animal, because it is definitely not a human. And that shit is fucking annoying at a low level. Like, on the way up to the guard things, not the white, they're not the guards, the graybeards, there's a fucking ice troll. Oh my god, is he not a bitch. Some difficult stuff, in my opinion. What's all this fun stuff? Let's just search the chest. Um, alright. Let's take this. And I came from that way. So we can, we can, uh, hmm, go one way, and it's that way. We're gonna take these things, because I think we can take these little hearts. Ah, we cannot take those. Let us be on our way. Wrecked. I don't know if you noticed, but in my, like, last Dead Island video, I think it was the last one, so five, I didn't do as much fast forwarding as I usually do, and the video is kind of long. It wasn't only long just because I didn't do as much fast forwarding, but the video was an hour so long recording. But I, like, I want to know, like, because like I said earlier in this video, should I do more fast forwarding or should I just do cutting right to where I need to be? Because I want this to be, I want this and my Dead Island series to be the best they can be. I know not everyone is going to watch both because some people don't like one of the two games or something. But I just want to know because I want them to be the best they can be. Holy shit, we're gonna die. Alright, I'm not gonna use the health potion because I'm pretty sure when you level up, your health goes up completely. I'm gonna level up my health. Okay, we're gonna put something towards heavy armor. Put one towards that. And let's go to two-handed for a second. Alright. Mmm. Battle axes do more bleeding damage. I'll level that up. This bleeding damage is quite nice. I'll use my shout, which did absolutely nothing. All right, we're gonna die. We are very, 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 very close to dying. All right, um, let's do this. Maybe we can kill. Oh, oh my God, we're so. D we literally have no health right now, basically. All right, let's just use one of those. Maybe eat some some bread. Oh yeah, you crunch that shit, boy. It does like nothing for my health. Oh my god, we're gonna die. We're, we're gonna die. We're so close to dying. We are going to fucking die. Alright, what do we got? What do we have? Where are we? What do we got? We have nothing. Nothing. We're gonna die. Okay, we're honestly gonna die. Oh, he's dead. All that work for fucking nothing. I already looked in that chest. Alright, that was not worth it. Alright, what's down here? A wall of web. Can I go through here? I can. There's a chest. Not a whole lot. Ooh, there's a chain. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Alright, there we go. Ah, oh, fuck. Am I gonna get killed by this witch, too? What the fuck? No, don't run down there. I don't even want to chase you, honestly. Breathing water. Let's take it. Alright, I've got to take... Ah, 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 
Oh shit. Fuck, yep. I saw a fucking fireball thing come at me and boom, it hits me. It just fucking slaps you. Damn it. Fuck. Ah. Uh, we're not gonna do this again. How does that sound? That sounds pretty good. Alright, shit. I don't even. I, now I don't even remember which way is the right way. I think it's up here. 1v1, we mate. Get wrecked. Oh my god, are we here? I would fucking kill you right now. You shouldn't talk to me like that. Why? Yeah. yeah. What are you gonna do? Cry? Back off, intimidate. Yeah. I don't have to take that from you. Fucking one v one me, mate. Yeah, yeah. Suck my ass, boy. Yeah, trying to heal. Can't do that shit. There's a nice little note. Go to the island near the edge of the lake. Look for where a great tree once stood. That is where I buried it. I'll check it out later. I'll probably watch a YouTube video on what the hell that means. <laughs> where the fuck did you come from? Dark Elf. Oh shit. I did nothing to deserve such memes. Oh. Okay. Eat. My. Ass. I remember last time I went to this place. When I went to Iverset, it did not take this long. I think, like, right up around here when I was like, should I keep going this way or should I go up? I, I think if I went up, I would have been there by now. But, you know. Too late now. Alright, what is this? What are you up to? Thanks, mate. It's a mission for another day. Holy shit. We're so close. It's, like, literally right there. Die. Okay, never mind. Dank. See, imagine if I fast traveled, or not fast traveled, imagine if I fast forwarded the whole walk here. That would literally be about fucking half an hour. <laughs> half an hour of fast forwarding. That would not be exciting, to be honest. We're gonna talk to the inn owner real quick, because I believe every time you talk to an inn owner, they can offer you a new quest. And I'll work on that another day. Alright, heard any rumors lately? I'm pretty sure if I rent a room and go to sleep, eventually when you do that, you like wake up in like Dark Brotherhood or someplace like that because they'll be like recruiting you, or you have to some somewhere later on you can eventually do that. I would try it right now, but I have shit to get done. Who are, who are you? Okay, ask Wilhelm about Rita. What's wrong with you? Okay, here have a piece of gold. Okay, I don't think there's anything over here. Um, I guess, I guess let's keep going to where we need to go. Now we need to make our way up this giant fucking hill. This I might fast forward because I don't really want to cut this though because this is sort of important. I'm just gonna skip to everything he has to say. I'm surprised that I actually listened to everything that the end guy was saying. Because usually I had to skip through everything, but I actually listened to what he had to say. I was kind of interested. I'm used to not skipping anything right now because of my Dead Island Let's Play. I don't skip anything. But now I'm just skipping these people because they don't have anything interesting to say. Maybe, if you want to let me know, if you want me to skip through dialogue, I will. I mean, right now I'm skipping through dialogue, but I'm surprised I didn't do it with the end guy. But every other person I pretty much usually do. But if you want me to stay and listen to the, all the dialogue, let me know. But if you want me to skip it, let me know. Anyway, I have 7,000 fucking stairs to make up. So... <coughs> Enjoy that, and listen to some shitty Undertale music as I fast forward this ass. Thank <laughs> you. 
We're here, and there's nothing in this chest. Alright, I have no idea how long this video is because fucking 85% of it was just walking around, and a lot of it's gonna be cut out because I don't feel like fast forwarding it because I'm, I wanna like do more just cutting out rather than fast forwarding everything. Because, like I said, if I just fast forwarded it, then this whole video would be very fucking long. So, this one is a lot of cutting out, so it's going to be fairly long. A dragon bond appears. We're just gonna skip everything. Okay, no, we're not. It's not letting me. I'm answering your summons. We will see. Who are you? What is this place? I want to find out what it means to be Dragonborn. I am answering your summons, Master. Alright, alright, you just gotta fucking help me out, man. Help me out. Help me out. I don't care about anything you have to say. I just wanna get this done with. What's good? Combine it with fuss or force to focus your thumb. Row. Row dank. Give me that shit, boy. Please. Alright, what is it doing? It's taking a while. Alright, there we go. Row. Thanks for the soul, old man. Okay, demonstrate your unrelenting force, shout. Row dank. Oh, shit, I have to, oh, I have to do it at targets. Boom. Get wrecked. Aluhuakwa. Master Bori, where are you? Hello. Shit, he's so old, he walks so slow. I will probably never use the shout that I'm going to learn, which is like whirlwind spin or some shit like that. Sprint where you like, go super fast, I'll probably never use it. Cause I just think it's fucking pointless. Alright, like, are you gonna teach me the shout, or what? what's going on? Are you summoning the shit, or like, what's happening? Like, what the hell? Alright, finally, Jesus. Thank you. Give me your knowledge, please. Thank you. Demonstrate your whirlwind sprint shout. <coughs> Let me activate it. There we go. Alright, he's gonna like, zoom right through here like Sanic. Sanic speed. Sanic speed! My turn. Alright. BAM! Alright, let's speak. Alright, so, that is that. And we started the horn of Jurgen Windcaller, or some shit like that. And we're starting to build up quite the list of miscellaneous quests, which is good, because on 360, it literally just scrolled on forever and ever. Alright, so, now what I'm gonna do is, when uh, they're in the little temple-y thing over there, and they're, like, praying or whatever, you can go up behind them and crouch and then just hit him in the back a shit ton of times to level up your sneak. I'm going to do that, but I'm not going to show me doing that. And by the time I come back, I'm going to have either level 50 or level 100 smithing. It depends on how long I feel like doing this and how long it's going to take to make the next video. And there's a hair in my mouth. Oh, God. But yeah, I'm going to do that, but I'm not going to show me doing it because I get very boring and it's, it's not very exciting. But yes, this is episode 3 of my Skyrim Let's Play. I'm gonna double check. Okay, my mic is not muted. My mic is not fucking muted. Anyway, guys, if you liked this, remember to like, comment, subscribe, see you, goodbye, and thank you for watching.